Hello friends, today we are going to talk about the no hurry objection. Normally people would like to procrastinate and generally people are not very comfortable taking immediate decisions. But when this procrastination takes a longer time, then it becomes an issue. So therefore we need to give various examples to clients about why uh, you know what is going to be the problem or what is going to be the consequence of their uh, delaying this decision. We cannot ask people to or we cannot force people to take a decision immediately because they definitely need to think about it. They need to sleep over it and therefore do not pressurize people to, to basically take a decision immediately. But if the delaying or the postponement keeps uh, getting delayed again and again <laughs> over a period of time, then we need to you know, take care that this is a procrastination and it's an established fact. So one of the very interesting examples that I give, which is what you can see on the screen, is about a cyclist who is cycling up a hill. So if the hill is, you know, so if when he's cycling, if the height of the hill and the, you know, from the base where he is uh, cycling, if the distance is too small, obviously the angle will be very high. It will be, it will be very steep. And therefore, there will be a problem in this person being able to reach at the top. Now, why this happened is because he has kept a very sharp angle. The angle is very, very sharp and therefore the cycle, it will be almost impossible for him to cycle. But suppose if he keeps the angle quite low, maybe at uh, you know 30 or 40 degrees, then what happens is the distance from where he starts increases and because of that the angle decreases <coughs> and therefore he is able to cycle very, very, you know, uh, properly and he'll be able to reach the destination. The effort that will be required in the second case will be very less compared to the effort that will be required in the first case. Now how does this match with our no hurry objection? It's very simple that if people delay the decision, so if they are having a longer time between their goal and if they start an investment program, the angle will be quite low and it will not be very difficult for, uh, for them to make the arrangement or the provision for their goal. But suppose if they, if they keep delaying, what will happen is the angle will keep on increasing. Okay, so it's like this, it will go on becoming like this, maybe 75 degrees. So if the angle is 70 degrees or 80 degrees, then it's nearly impossible to for the person to cycle and this is what you know the clients will very easily understand so what I do is I take a piece of paper uh, you know clean sheet of paper and I draw these two triangles so one is a triangle which has a very long base it has a short you know kind of a, a left hand side uh, you know side and uh, you know I show that triangle and I make another triangle which will have a long side uh, side and uh, you know very short bottom and then I will ask the customer sir what do you think which uh, you know if I show a cyclist you know trying to cycle I will ask him sir which triangle will it be more easy for the cyclist to reach the destination obviously the customer will point to the second figure that I am talking about the lower angle one and then you ask him, sir, why do you think uh, it will be difficult for this guy? Because of course, he'll say the angle is quite steep. And then the reason is you should connect. That, sir, the angle is steep is because he has kept delaying, delaying, delaying. And therefore, the lower side is become very less. The upper side is very high. And therefore, uh, you know, the upper side remains basically same in both. But because the lower side is short, it becomes very steep but if the lower side is long then it is much easier because the angle will be short and therefore Mr. Client if you delay your decision then a day will come where it will be impossible for you to reach your goal 
using the you know the investment proposition or the saving proposition so when you start early you have to save less but you also save it for a longer time it's more comfortable and you would be more confident to reach your destination to reach your goal rather than delaying it and then making the amount of investment too high so sir by signing on this form today you are taking a commitment to reduce the angle of the triangle so that you are able to be more confident and comfortable in reaching your goal so can you just please sign here thank you very much